In this video, we're going to take a look at how you can create copies of a specific vector along a curve. And I'll show you how you can do this. So here you can see this vector that I've created, which is this simple love heart. And let's say that I want to create some copies of this. So let's say I draw a line from there to there. And I want to create a few copies of this along that line. Now to do this, you can use the paste along a curve. So to select it, go up to the top here and you've got paste along a curve. So this basically copies the selected object along a vector. So if I open that, it basically gives me this dialog box and at the very top it says select object and curve and you can also specify the number or you can specify the distance. What I tend to do is first of all before I open the tool is select the vectors and then I automatically open the tool. Now it's entirely up to you how you do this. What you need to do is select the object as it says at the top there so that's the object that you want to copy and then press shift and select the curve that you want to copy it along so let's just use the default value so number of copies free and paste okay now what's happened here is it's rotated it around so that's one thing that you need to bear in mind when you actually do this is that it will align itself to that line okay so if i undo that and then let's change it to let's say 10 copies and it will create 10 copies along that line you've also got specified distance so if i make this a little bit larger so you can see that so let's say the space in big between copies is two inches and paste. So between each one of these is two inches. Now if I make that quite large, let's say six inches, and then I make the spacing even, it will put one at the front and one at the back, and then put one even spaced in the center. So if I do that again and turn off make spacing even, you can see that it starts on this point, but the very end point, it doesn't go to the very end. That's not the center of that heart. Okay, so if I do that again, make spacing even, you can see that it now goes to the center of that heart. Okay, so that's what that's for. So let's undo that, specify a number. So you can do this around any curve, any vector that you want to. So let's say I've got a circle. Make sure that you select the love heart or the object that you want to copy and then select the drive or the, the, the curve that you want it to go around. And then select paste. Okay, and it creates a nice copy around there. can also do this with curvy vectors so if I wanted to go like that just select the heart first of all and then select the rail that you'd like to sweep it around okay so that's how you create copies along a curve